Never me in my big mouth. We just threw the showers for his wax job, Shaggy. Hey! Shay, Scoob, you weren't supposed to be in on this. <laughs> well, it looks like you captured the wax phantom. But who's who? The two small ones are Shaggy and Scooby, and the big one's the phantom, whom they so artistically captured. In his own wax. And now for the unwaxing. Oh, oh. Okay, Scoop. You gotta be good. Now, Mr. Wax Phantom, time to find out who you really are. Hey, you're chipping them down to regular size. Mr. Roger Stevens, the TV station manager. And I wish you'd have minded your own business. Well, in this case, it's police business. Like we thought old Waxy was really a ghost. Or at least old Grisby was behind it. No, Shaggy. That's just what Stevens wants us to think. While he escapes to South America with all the money he embezzled. Sure. Stevens knew of old Grisby's threat to bring the wax phantom to life. So he used the phantom disguise. Then Grisby would be blamed for everything. Including Stevens' disappearance. I'll take him now, kids. Thanks. Hey, Scoob, aren't our wax statues the greatest? Yeah. Just what are you fellas going to do with those wax dummies you made? Well, like simple. Next time we have a mystery, those dummies can go instead of us. There's only one problem. How to tell one pair of dummies from the other. <laughs> Very funny. Very funny. Yeah. Very funny.